The character of Dublin city today was very much defined in the 18th century period, in a time that we call the Georgian period. The long red brick terraces, the squares, the grid form and pattern of its streets, the great public buildings. It's also very much a, a contemporary city. The city has seen um, new buildings shaping the way the city looks and informing on the way people experience it. We sadly saw a great deal of, of demolition of our 18th century and 19th century Georgian heritage. The decline that we saw in the first half of the 20th century has to a degree been reversed. New uses are being found for houses and new life is being brought to streets like St. William Street. St. William Street is considered the most cosmopolitan street in the city and it's bustling with shops and restaurants and coffee shops. And sitting at the heart of that is this hidden gem of the City Assembly House. For much of the last 200 years, the building has not been used for its original intended purpose. Sitting in the middle of the City Assembly House is its great octagonal exhibition room. This was built to show the works of Irish artists in the 18th century. It was built so as to form a centre of education for artists. Here we now are in the 21st century and the Irish Georgian Society is reintroducing that original purpose to the building. The supporters of the Irish Georgian Society have been extraordinarily generous in enabling the Society to bring the City Assembly House to its current state. The Irish Georgian Society has been able to move into the building. It's now our headquarters. It's from the City Assembly House that we run our educational programs and our conservation programs and our advocacy programs. The next challenges we have in the restoration of this building will be the refurbishment of the exhibition room. So in this space we'll see it being reinstated to its original character. We'll need to restore the basement. Unfortunately there was a fire in the basement a number of years ago, so that's in very poor condition. The front elevation and the side elevation of the building, the railings are in poor condition. The mortar and the brickwork and the stonework all requires repointing. It's very important for the Irish Georgian Society that we make the building as accessible to as many people as possible. To achieve that we're installing a wheelchair lift along with associated services. The restoration and the revitalization of the City Assembly House will only be possible through the support of our members and of those who have an enthusiasm for Ireland's cultural heritage. It's the ambition of the Irish Georgian Society to complete the restoration of the City Assembly House so that it can serve as a centre for celebrating Ireland's cultural heritage in the historic heart of Dublin.